Hey guys, what's going on? I just wanted to um, share with you guys the uh, CMC Double Break Escape Artist. As you can see, um, this is first generation. It's um, I'm very very satisfied with it. I just um, I didn't see any reviews on it, so I was gonna give my own. I've been using this one now for about two years. Um, very very satisfied that I just can't say that enough. Um, as you as you can see, it's not ridiculously large. It's and I, in my opinion, it's lighter than the Grigri. I I have not weighed the Grigri or had much experience with it, but at least you know this is NFPA nineteen eighty three certified. Um, it is a little pricey. It's around ninety two ninety five dollars. And I don't even know if this one is still in production. Um, FFGDP actually has um, the new second generation one. If you guys want to check his channel out. So, um, so I'll just give you, um, show you guys the diagram on it real quick. As you can see there. Oh, there we go. She's in focus now. Uh, show you the mechanism on the inside. This one, if it looks a little looks a little shiny on the inside because uh, been used a time or two. the back side here. Now I can see if I can get the spot here. There is oh there you go. There is your second cam right there. Right here. That's your second break. So that's the break for you to squeeze it. Then when you open it up, that's your top break. So I'll I'll re rig I'll rig this in a second for you and I'll show you exactly how it has to be. Rigging it is quite the uh, hassle, I must say. I um, I took the line out for the video just just to show you the exact item by itself, and now I have to re-rig it because this is my own personal one. So re-rigging is a must. I'll then pass back the, around again. Passing underneath. Come on, come on. There we go. Back up again. There you go. She is now rigged. Give you a good look at that. I have to get a little closer for the camera to act up. There we go. Now, as you see, for your outbreak, bends the rope there. That pinches it. Oops, wrong finger. Pinches it right here. Now, underneath, this cam here, and you squeeze it. Or bite into the rope, as you can see. So that's how that's how the um, that's how the mechanism works. As you see here from this diagram, let's see if I can get this focus back in a second. Oh, I don't want to run away. Anchor's right here. It's the anchor point right here. And um, see if I can see if I can find the sweet spot in this. There we go. Now, once you release, once that is released, no matter how hard you jerk it, will not go anywhere. If you squeeze it too much, the line will not feed out either. 
you have to find that sweet spot in there. Now, the other thing about this is, I have to be on to this for this next operation here. Um, the brake is not affected when you are pulling on the opposite end. So, that's it, that's it folks, as you see here. That's my own personal device. Like I said, if you want to see the uh, second generation, check out FFGDP, and uh, he'll take it from there. Thank you.